Oh, it's not about the scale, about the scale, just the numbers. It's not about the scale, about the scale, just the measurements. It's not about the scale, about the scale in your clothes, not about the scale. It's really how you feel. Hey guys, it's Becky and I'm here to talk to you today that it's not about the scale. Use the scale as a measurement tool. Use it to measure your progress. Use it to see where you're at. Don't be obsessed and measure yourself on the scale every single day, because guess what? You're gonna set yourself up for disappointment. You're gonna see it fluctuate. Your body is gonna retain fluid. Maybe you're going through that time of the month. Ladies, we are notorious for going up and down. If you weigh yourself every single day, you're crazy. Let me say this, you're stupid. Stupid choice for you to make if you're weighing yourself every day. Go every seven days, go every 14 days. Give yourself a measurement tool. So here's what I'm gonna say. Body muscle weighs more than body fat. Let me say it again. Your muscle weighs more than fat. If you put your pants on and you've got more lean muscle, it's gonna take up less space than your fat is, okay? But on the scale, it's gonna weigh more. So when you get on the scale and you see the numbers go up if you've been working out, don't let that get you upset and frustrated because you're probably building lean muscle. And lean muscle means that your metabolism is raising faster and you're gonna burn more fat throughout the day and you're gonna be healthier. Focus on your health, focus on your choices, focus on 80% nutrition. 20% your exercise and make sure you have a good balance in your lifestyle. 68 months ago, I weighed 123 pounds. I'm gonna show you what I weigh today and it'll probably blow you away. Now I'm personally working on a goal to reduce my body fat and increase my lean muscle. And honestly, I don't care. I don't give a hoot what that scale says because that messed with me for 20 years and I developed an eating disorder because I got obsessed about a number. So I just want you to see where I'm at today and keep in mind, 68 months ago, I was 123 pounds. Let's go. Not about the scale. It's not about the scale. Now, do we want to see the scale move if we're on a weight loss program or we're um, dieting or we're going for lean muscle or holy cow, we're in the 40s? Yeah. But use it as a tool. Do not use it as a measuring, determining factor. Wow. 142. So I'm at 142. I'm 20 pounds heavier than I was 68 months ago when I was at 123. But you know what, I'm not gonna let that bother me because my self-help matters and your self-help matters too. So take your self-help into your own hands. Make it matter. Challenge yourself to take control of your nutrition. Get out there and start making a change. And don't be obsessed with the scale. It's not all about that scale. It's not all about those numbers. Have a great day. Bye-bye.